Hi, this is Quentin from Quentin Vision Golf, and today it's 2016. And my revolution for the new year is that I'm going to get better at golfing. So today the drill, what today the drill is how to get out of the sand trap in two different ways. So the first one is like that, and you're holding it like that. So it's going to be like that, and then the second one is going to be like that, like that. So the club face is kind of upwards. That will make the ball go higher, and this one will make it go faster and a bit on the ground. So let's get started. I have my three balls here. And so the first one I'm going to do is this way. And you can't touch the ground when you're in your tournament with your uh, club. You can't touch the sand. But when you're in your stroke, you can. No, you can take practice strokes, but you can't just touch, you can't touch the sand. But in your real stroke, you can. Now that one went a little shorter because I hit the sand before I hit the ball. So let's try it again. Just near the hole, but if you get it in the hole, it's, it's great. Everybody will cheer. Now that time it went a little farther. That's because I hit the ball with the center of my club face near the center of my club face, so like right there. So went a little farther. So the second one I'm gonna do is with the club face a little up. That time it hit the little barrier here. Plus, I didn't actually hit the ground, so it just sped along the ground. There we go. So that time I hit it like that. And it went pretty far. Went across the side. So yeah. I mean, you can touch the ground once you uh, start your swing. Okay, so I got out, but it didn't go that far. I think because of that is because I hit the ground right before I hit the ball. So that's why I like went up and then down. But it is gonna be hard to hit because there's loads of frost. And the sand, it's like frozen together. So yeah. I smacked it like over there or something. Wait, is that it? I don't know. I can't I can't find it. Well, you can go anywhere. So I've been practicing so long that we're losing light and it's getting dark outside. But I just want to say this. Sand can be an evil beast sometimes. But you can tame it if you have your sand trap skills down. So, I hope you like, subscribe, share, and comment if you want me to do any other drills. See you next time. Bye.